Welcome to MrNussbaum.com and thank you for watching this video about our fraction games. If you are teaching fractions and you're looking for fun yet meaningful fraction themed activities for your students, well you've definitely come to the right place. All of these games are free for all as always. And if the advertisements prove too distracting, you can always subscribe to MrN365.com, our ad-free subscription service that only costs $23.70 per year. And it is available once you subscribe to your entire class with unlimited usage. So our original fraction games are bound to get your students excited about and interested in fractions. And the purpose of this video is to quickly explain some of our fraction games. I'm not going to individually demonstrate any of them as videos for how to play each game are included on the site. Our games reinforce, among other things, identifying fractions, reducing them, comparing fractions, ordering fractions, making equivalent fractions, and converting fractions to decimals and decimals to fractions. So now I'm going to explain about a couple of these. The newest fraction game I have is located right here. It's called The Legend of the Golden Pizza, an amazing fractions adventure. Um, this is developed with the spirit of the really popular game Prodigy in mind. Students must explore a secret network of rooms behind a pizzeria to find the eight slices of pizza that together form the golden pizza. Of course, they must use their fraction skills to defeat the ghouls and goblins that protect each slice. This is perfect for your students um, who are in grades four and up. It reinforces multiple different kinds of fraction skills, including picking the largest the, the largest fraction, comparing fractions, reducing fractions, and identifying fractions. Um, and if you click on this, you'll find uh, not only the game itself, but an additional video exactly how to play this game and explaining about this game in more detail. Okay, moving along. Our second offering is Tony Fractions Pizza Shop. And this is one of the most popular games on the entire site. Here, Students play the role of a pizza shop owner with really picky customers. Students must fulfill as many orders as possible in five minutes, which is tricky when you have a customer who orders their toppings in fractions. For example, they might say something like, I'll have a large pizza, uh, you know, one fourth cheese, um, three eighths pepperoni, and um, I, don't, I guess you'd say three eighths mushroom. And then the student has to fix that pizza perfectly. Um, so in this game, actually, uh, which is great for friendly competitions within the classroom, if your if you're students like that kind of thing, um, it does have a timer, but you can disable the timer as well and just practice. Okay, moving along. Let's go down to sand dollar exchange this is a fun one this one is probably appropriate for for grades three and up it's a little simpler than the other ones um and it is a very fun game and you play the role of a surly crab who must rearrange the bits of broken sand dollars to their correct fractional labels and this game has three levels each that's slightly harder than the others and so you can see there's lots of other fraction games. Death to Decimals is one of my favorites, and it's for a little bit of an older group. I'd say grades five and up. You play the role of a fraction superhero, and you're battling uh, decimals who are trying to destroy the entire concept of fractions. Um, you're a superhero who must save the world from horrible parachuting decimal aliens by converting them to harmless fractions. And this game also has levels, and you go from one city in the world to others trying to defeat these, uh, these decimals. You use uh, your, 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 you shoot calculators at them to destroy them. Um, and this is a lot of fun. Uh, I, I, this is another one of my very original games. Um, again, and it, it, it reinforces converting fractions to decimals and decimals to fractions. Um, lots and lots of other games here. Um, I have some, you know, some of these are available in Spanish. Tony Fractions Pizza Shop is also available in French. Um, let's see if there's anything else. I, well, they're all great games. Um, Sushi Fractions is another 
one where students actually have to draw fractions and then um, put the correct fillings in, in them. Um, learners must use their fraction drawing skills to make sushi to their customers' specifications. The object is to ensure all eight customers leave as happy customers. Uh, of course, it's easier said than done. Some customers are very demanding about the accuracy of their orders and others are more flexible. There's a line tool to create the fractions to form the sushi. Um, and the system actually compares drawings with the correct fraction divisions and will give you an accuracy score. How, how well, how closely did you actually draw the fraction? Well, this video is only very quick and I mostly described three of the games. I encourage you to sample all of the fraction games, which are all equally as valuable for learning, reinforcement, and fun. If you find this video useful, please like it. Subscribe to my YouTube channel, Mr. Nussbaum.com for more videos.